We may yet be able to save Bastila. I don't know. I'm hoping we can. You know, it's still left open because, hey, you know, she's still alive. But we'll see. We just don't know. We just don't know what's going to happen. I guess we'll soon find out, though. Oh, where are we going? That way. The reason I walked here rather than going via a map is in case someone was waiting for us. Like, at some point. Like that, I guess. Wow, we're all here. You're back. But where's Bastila? I is she alive? What happened inside that temple? Um. All right. Do I tell her or, or uh, him or what? Um. I'm, I'm, I. We don't have time to deal with this. Let's just go. Hold on a second. What about Bastila? Wasn't she in the temple? What? What happened? Okay. Fine. She's fallen to the dark side and she fled to the Star Forge. Okay. We want you to know. There it is. The dark side. Bastila. No. No. How could that happen? She was always in danger of being seduced by the dark side, Karth. Bastila was strong, but she was always impatient and headstrong. Malak preyed upon her weakness. This planet is a tainted place. The Star Forge and the Temple have twisted the Force <laughs> into an instrument of evil, just as Malak has twisted Bastila into a servant of the Sith. Can she still be saved? Malak has a strong hold on Bastila now. It will be difficult for her to break free of his influence, especially considering her long association with you. Remember the bond that was forged between you when she rekindled the spark that was your life. Through that bond, she touched your memories, and also the echo of the dark taint within you. But there's still hope for her, right? I mean, Revan rejected the dark side, so Basila could too, right? We still might be able to save her. Right? We can try, and we will. I don't know what fate awaits us, but I sense Bastila still has a role to play in the events to come. I have no doubt she will be waiting for us on the Star Forge. No doubt. Duh. Let's go then before she has time to organize a bigger welcoming committee. Okay. Okay, with well, the ship parts, I may be able to re to repair. May be able to. I'd, I'd rather think that I sh will be able to. What is that? Engine room. This hyperdrive. Oh yeah, it's a bit broken, isn't it? Right, what a surprise. Yes, I can. <laughs> we'd be a bit screwed there if we got the parts and be like, ah, it doesn't work. What? Yeah, we're missing a flux capacitor. Oh. Well, we're kind of like stuck here forever then, aren't we? Yes, what's on your mind? You got it. Just check in that you knew something. So... Hmm. So now what? Go in here again? I guess. Yeah, we're already here. So, uh, how do I get off the planet? Karth, do you mind, uh... Do you mind taking us up into the star system? At all. Please. Karth. It's, it's time for you to do your thing, dude. Hmm. Yeah. Uh. Um. Oh, wait a minute. There we go. Fleet must have gotten a message I sent as we were crashing into that planet. I'm picking up a transmission from them now. This is Admiral Fawn Dodonna to the Avon Hawk. Do you read us? Admiral Dodonna, this is Karth Anassi. We're receiving your transmission. Karth, I'm glad to see you're still alive. We've begun our assault on the Star Forge, but we're taking heavy losses. 
How did the Sith ever manage to build something of this scope? The Starforge wasn't constructed by the Sith, Admiral. We don't have time for me to fully explain it, but that space station is far older than you can imagine. Maybe we should pull the fleet back and retreat. I don't know if we have the firepower to go up against this alien technology. You can't do that, Admiral. The Starforge is a factory of immense power. It's been churning out the capital ships, snub fighters, and assault droids that have powered the Sith war effort. You have to destroy the Starforge now, or you'll be fighting an unending wave of reinforcements. Then I guess we have no choice. But it isn't going to be easy. I can't even get our capital ships into position to start bombarding the Starforge. The Sith fleet is too well organized. It's like they can guess our every move and counter our every strategy. It's because of Bastila, Admiral. She turned to the dark side and became Malak's apprentice. We suspect she's somewhere on that space station right now, using her battle meditation against you and your fleet. This is Master Vandor. A number of Jedi Knights have joined our fleet under his command. If Bastila is using her power to augment the Sith, then Malak's fleet is invincible. Our only hope is to somehow stop Bastila from using her battle meditation. How can we do that if she's on the space station? I will send a squadron of Jedi Knights to the Starforge to find Bastila. Their small ships will be able to fly through the Sith blockade and dock on the space station. If they can find Bastila, they may be able to distract her attention from the battle overhead. That should allow you to move your capital ships into position for a final assault on the Starforge itself. I hate to ask this after all you've done, Karth, but the Jedi may need all the help they can get. Don't worry, Admiral. The Evanhawk and her crew are gonna see this through to the end. And may the Force be with you. Oh well, at least we, get sh we didn't get shot down on the way in here, which is good. So, hmm, Starforge. I'm actually nervous. We're finally here on the Starforge. I should talk to Karth, because I don't think I'm going to use Karth for this. I'm going to stick to the Jedi party. So let's, uh... Yes, what's on your mind? Anything about this place? I don't really know much about this place. Sorry. <laughs> you got it. <laughs> yeah, it's alright. Alright then. So that might be the last we've heard of Karth. I am assuming of course I'm just assuming that, you know, this is the final area. And again, I assumed that the final area was, was like two areas ago, so um But I know we're getting close anyway. We are certainly getting there. So Oh, uh yeah, 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 yeah. We got some nice um Um Stones, didn't we? Right, that one's the weakest. Hmm. Let's just take them all out and then use the best ones, okay? And fine, you can have a red one. Um, so no. That's really good, okay? So top one is five. What else have we got? Bolt deflection, more damage. Tap bonus two against droids. Stunning. Tap bonus one. All right, so I reckon that's as good as it's gonna get. Okay, so I got that one, that one, and that one. Okay, so our lightsaber is a pretty kick-ass right now, which is good because we're gonna be using them. You. And you. Yeah, I never thought I'd be using her, but it just seems to fit. 
So that's what we're going to do.